welcome to my house. Do, 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 do. <laughs> so welcome to the Work Brighter Clubhouse. I am so excited to have you here. While you're here and since you're new, I just want to show you around a little bit. There are three main compar- components or areas or rooms, if you will, of the clubhouse. Slack, the info hub, and the Zoom room. And I'm just going to take you on a quick tour through all three of them, kind of like MTV Cribs Clubhouse Edition. Um, so first up, we have the Slack team. I love that we're on Slack and not any kind of social media group because this way when you're here, you're here, you're not getting distracted by anything else, no advertising, no political whatever, and no drama just you know just the clubhouse and you can customize notifications you can customize the platforms you can customize all kinds of stuff and I will tell you more about learning those slack tips later on Um, so the first thing in the slack area is the general announcements channel Um, this is just kind of like the front door where you can see any flyers we've posted like upcoming themes new channels upcoming events stuff like that. Uh, You will not be able to post in the announcements channel. This is just where I can broadcast out any important messages and you can make sure to see them. So there's that. And then the main area that we will be hanging out in is the water cooler, which is exactly what it sounds like. The idea is that it's just kind of a virtual water cooler that you can go to on your work breaks and we all chat about various different things throughout the day, support each other, all that wonderful stuff. Um, The other two important channels that I want to note are co-working and happy hour. These are our event channels where we meet at predetermined times for virtual events and all hang out together. On Mondays and Wednesdays we co-work and get some work done together. Um, On Fridays, we have a short happy hour where we celebrate the progress that we've made and all that work that we got done. There are also a few topical topical channels like habits, mindset, productivity, self-care, technology, and we add new ones as they come up in our monthly learning themes. Um, More about those in a second. Um, We also have a help channel for any requests you want to make. Um, promo, uh, we do have limits on how much you can self promote in this group in the clubhouse and it's in this dedicated channel. So if you don't want any part of the self promotional stuff, you don't have to have any part of it. You just don't join that channel. If you do want to take part, we all support each other and there is a limit. So it's, um, really is like take more or, um, give more than you take and there are limits on how much you can promote and stuff like that. Um, but it is a great way that we can all keep up with what we're, um, creating and promoting in business since there are a lot of content creators and writers and business owners in the group. Random is kind of self-explanatory. And then finally, the final channel I want to point out to you is work in public. And the idea for that is that is where we just kind of make note of all the progress and things that we're working on throughout the day or week or month. And I will be your accountability cheerleader or accountability fetch, whichever one you need. Just let me know. Um, So you can post what you're working on and we will follow up with you on it. And it's a great way to brag about the progress you've made or talk out any troubles you're having. And it's just really, really helpful. And so that is it for the Slack Slack team or Slack room. And in addition to that, we have the Clubhouse Info Hub. And this is just where we have all of the different um, important information about the Clubhouse, along with uh, all of the different courses and tools and templates and other resources that are included in the Clubhouse. So first up, there is just the information area. And this is just, you know, basic information on getting started, um, like accessing the Slack team, um, tips for using Slack, uh, this video. Um, Then there's also stuff around the Clubhouse directory that I have set up for you so you can get to know other members really quickly by browsing their information. You can message anyone that you want to get to know better in Slack, or if you're a little bit nervous about that, you can reach out to me 
through this form right here and I will actually introduce you. There's also ways you can get, in, get involved, um, like sharing feedback, uh, writing a guest post for the WorkWriter blog, becoming an affiliate. Uh, and of course, you can cancel your membership at any time. It is month to month or year to year, whatever you've selected as your payment plan. And if you ever want to stop future payments, you can just request a cancellation through here. And that is all the important um, kind of housekeeping information about the clubhouse. And then also in the info hub is all of these cool, amazing, useful templates, courses, tools, kits, and stuff like that. Um, some of them correspond to some of our monthly themes in the clubhouse, our monthly learning themes. For example, in December, we did a good old decluttering to start the year fresh, and this is a, de um, a group of decluttering prompts to help you do that. And then in January, our theme was habit building, and inside here is a habit building workshop, a toolkit of habit trackers, habit planners. Lots of fun stuff, um, totally included here. And so these, um, some of these are also just different courses and uh, tools like workbooks or templates that I've created for the Clubhouse members. We've got Airtable templates coming soon. There's going to be Notion templates. And new stuff is being added every month, whether on its own or through the monthly learning themes that we have. And which brings us to the last component of our tour of our cribs, uh, which is the Zoom room, which I can't show you right now because it's Zoom. <laughs> um, but uh, it is conference call software that we use to get together twice a month. And that is when we do our monthly learning themes together. Um, so once a month, there is a workshop where I will teach information based on the monthly theme and then a few weeks later we will have a group coaching call on that topic and so this is um, this will vary throughout the year sometimes it's seasonal stuff like decluttering and habit building sometimes we'll have themes let that are good year round and at the end of every month any important information from the theme will get added to the learning hub or the info hub over here so that you can easily reference it in the future. And that is it for MTV Cribs Clubhouse Edition. Hope they don't sue me for that name. <laughs> Maybe just Cribs Clubhouse Edition. And I'll see you inside.